Breaking tonight, a Vermont sheriff arrested. It stems from an investigation that started back in March into allegations of sexual assault against Addison County Sheriff Peter Newton. NBC 5's Carolyn Sistrin is live in Burlington this evening with the latest from his court appearance. Carolyn. Addison County Sheriff Peter Newton was able to walk out of the courtroom today, not in handcuffs on an unsecured $100,000 bond after being brought up on four counts, two of which were sexual assault accounts related to incidents that happened back in February. The state is requesting conditions that he not leave the state due to the fact that he faces counts that could result in a life in prison sentence. He has been told to stay at least 300 feet away from the victim and not perform any law enforcement duties. The sheriff is still allowed to remain in his role, but there were no additional details into how his job description will change for the time being. That $100,000 unsecured bond means Newton must appear in court when directed. Otherwise, that is the amount that he will owe. Now, Washington County State's Attorney Rory Tebow, Tebow saying that the sheriff was able to walk out partially due to his clean criminal record and another reason the state felt that it was important to make sure that he could not leave Vermont. I'll have more tonight on this arraignment at 6 o'clock and at 10 and 11 in Burlington. Carolyn Sistrian, NBC5 News. Carolyn, thanks. The Addison County High Bailiff calling for Newton's resignation tonight. In a statement released this afternoon, Dave Silberman said, it is simply impossible for Sheriff Newton to continue serving the community in a law enforcement capacity under the cloud of these very serious charges.